everyone and welcome to my channel this is Zima and I'm here with another garden session this is going to be a coffee cup reading for the month of September for the sign of Capricorn if you have Sun moon or rising in Capricorn or if you are watching as a cross watcher and there's someone who's dear to your heart and they are Capricorn um, you might want to watch this video I hope that everyone is doing well um, thank you for being here. Um, so, um, if you are interested in a private reading, you can find my um, contact in the About tab. Um, and with that, let's just get aligned um, with our energies. Maybe take a deep breath and uh, we can see what messages are here for us for Capricorn uh, for the month of September. What do we need to know? What is coming? What is up? And how uh, things are moving forward? Let's start the reading. Um, wow, there is a beautiful message coming to you. Uh, it will be an announcement. Uh, we'll get to that in the end of the reading. Okay, I definitely see a discussion, a conversation between two people. Some of you might feel like, however, or in any form and shape that you're communicating with someone, they are not responding or they're not receiving it or they are not, maybe even you think they don't really understand your point. There is a misalignment and some of you might be thinking about, um, you know, I need to take a different approach in um, making this thing clear to this person. They are really not getting what you mean or they are not understanding. And this could be annoying. This could bring some uh, discussions, some uh, even arguments on the table for some people. Um, so just be on the watch. Um, for some of you, it's not intentional. I don't see that this person is intentionally not listening to, to you. Um, I don't know why, but this person just, um, they haven't understood, they haven't, they didn't take the message. They didn't really, it didn't really click with them. They don't really know what they, they don't really know what you meant or something in those lines. So maybe some clarification can help someone, can, can help them uh, to get on the same page. Uh, that's definite. Um, be careful about the responsibilities that you have given to some people. Uh, I see a crown is falling from someone's head. People might find a, a alternatives or maybe you are even one of those uh, individuals who are thinking about alternatives uh, maybe you're not very much satisfied with your work with your job and somehow uh, an alternative is present an alternative is available and people are considering that um, in relation to um, I see letter A very beautifully like if your initial consists like you have letter A in your initial uh, you might be signing a contract something very important um, which brings a very very big change into your life you might want to keep it to yourself don't share it with everyone uh, when you get this message when you get this signature when this, you get this uh, even maybe blessing that that is that is solely for you um, very very nice very positive i see a separation someone might announce their separation from an organization and i really see that as like a, a like separation from an organization kind of thing and um yeah so um i see that a separation will happen with respect like both parties are respecting the other patient's decision and it's it's, it's fine but i see it's like in um uh financially i see you might have big ideas capricorn um, if you're thinking about leaving a job or leaving an organization or a practice or something because you got another bigger offer, um, I see that it's in, in general for a lot of you it's, possi it's positive and it's possible, but you need to be strategic. Don't break the, bridge, the bridges behind you and try to be political um, in your decision making process and in the way that you um, kind of terminate your job with, with the current like employer or current relationship whatever it is it can be any relationship it doesn't necessarily um it's not necessarily regarding job or um, something like that i don't know someone needs to change the carpets or the cover of something maybe the carpets at home um you need to 
or the tiles there's some renovation that i can see uh, again for that you might need to shop around don't just um i mean you need to get opinions from different people i would say um you have the you have your finance is going to be improved and there are uh, there are some things that you're going to share with someone um well you know some of you are are taking a risk but you're not very comfortable with it so i don't know you happen in some um maybe even situation or you made yourself in the middle of this situation that you are taking a risk and you're not really comfortable with it maybe it's um i don't know with your friends um you now said something that you have to do it and it's just a risk and you're not feeling 100 percent um comfortable with that but i don't see anything bad as long as you um take a like I don't know take action or your your as long as your actions are um okay i don't know how i can say as long as you don't cross the limits you don't cross the line you should be fine but i see that you are taking still taking it um very um, carefully even if you need to risk take the risk carefully i mean risks they don't mean that you just have to close your eyes and do whatever uh just think about it and be very strategic and try to plan uh, I see that you're taking, um, there is some uh, guard that you can take, there is some, uh, how can I say, safeguard for you, safety net that will be provided. So even if you have to make a risk or take a decision, make a decision very quickly, there is still some some room for, you know, to change flexibility. So um, that's actually very good. We might hear something from Africa or South America um something is very sharp i don't know there is a i see sharp thing um i don't know maybe something comes into number one be careful with sharp objects uh, i don't know scissors specifically specifically if kids are going back to school make sure that they don't have some like i don't know sharp objects well, there is a discussion uh, that two people are really wanting to have this discussion together they are even maybe um talking in their minds they're they're talking to each other in their minds they're practicing for this discussion they will say like i'll say this an important um interaction is coming up that uh, you are getting ready for for that someone is uh, taking swimming classes um and uh, maybe for children maybe you're a um, lifeguard or someone starts working as a lifeguard um good news is coming i see little joys that is coming but again see you're very much um focused on your finances your career and this is what you're totally focused on and some of you are starting a new position i see like um kind of um, tornadoes or some kind of storming in some countries um but it should be fine i don't see a lot of damage people might be scared something might happen that some people might feel scared again it could be a, like a mother of nature a surprise again or it can be something like just an event a news something an incident that someone really feels so scared i see that they feel like oh my god it's gonna be so bad but it will pass this uh, alarm this 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 concerning situation is going to be passed and they'll survive it should be fine um but again make sure that you you're taking caution caution you're cautious and you're taking caution about that some money is coming i see a lot of dust some of you might need to do some deep cleaning at home or maybe there is a storm or a, a big weather chain and change and there is a lot of dust and mud even maybe flooding in some places might see some flooding so unstable um weather condition is what i can see uh, here is yours your sign capricorn i see that um you will be outside of this situation you will survive or it's not going to impact you even maybe there is a storm at work or in the family or between friends um there is a big storm and discussions and arguments but you will be fine You're, you stay out of it don't get into it specifically if friends or a couple are having arguments or they have issues don't get involved if you don't need to um you know i see that uh, two slow moving um situations are coming to an end finally someone is pulling it together finally someone is putting it together they are trying to uh, close the loose ends and it's gonna be finished it's not you but i see that someone hasn't has been giving you a hard time with their uh, being a slow and taking their time and it might have uh, caused you a little bit of you know um, stress in that 
many things are coming on in on the surface for you many uh, news or many uh, people are showing their true face you get to recognize who's who and uh, what is the situation exactly it has been a lot of um, muddy situation foggy situation for you um, like a pile of unfinished work I see is there that you need to do and you feel really guilty about it some of you maybe have been on vacation or you were on leave and then you come back and there's a lot of things that you need to do the pile up is big for your to-do list for things that you need to catch up on or maybe something that you want to do and it has been just postponed I mean take a chance don't let it be just sitting there forever because other people are going to take advantage if you don't um, do it I see this is time to act and it's not as big and as difficult as you think sometimes you're procrastinating and you're just saying oh tomorrow I'll do it and I see some kind of laziness and uh, Capricorn, you're not usually lazy sign. You always take things into your hands and you, you are work, work, work. You are toward, uh, you are a go-getter. You are toward like finishing and crossing the finish line. So with that, I mean, you need to be a little bit more um, in the picture. Sometimes I see that you are uh, outside. Of, you're not on the stage. Um... I see two people are talking again a lot of talking in this uh, reading and um, but it's not involved you're not involved you might hear some conversations discussions from people or you might find that they are talking about you and again it might be a lot in the work situation in like uh, politics at work um, might you know sometimes make you um, aware of things and situations that you didn't know um, but there is potential for you to move fast in your organization. Uh, you need a big project is given to you and you need to just act on it. And again, take the chance and act on it. Otherwise, it will, they will give it to someone else. I mean, if you're not working, it can be some other possibility, some kind of responsibility, some kind of even idea that you have or something that you really want to do. And this is just a time for you to do it. I see a hardship here, yeah, really nice. Someone is approaching you with a good heart. It could be regarding uh, love and romance. They might have feelings for you or they just have a very good heart towards you, towards your action. They are coming with a good proposal and there is something out of it. Um, I see problems with a uh, with bathroom and you need to, uh, I don't know, there might be some renovation, as I said, for you. And there needs to be renovations, maybe literally like at home or innovations in your relations, in, you, in the way you handle things. Um, and sometimes when you evaluate yourself, you think that you could be at a higher position than you are. Right now, you think that you could do better and still there is a big chance for you to do that. And you can, with Mars being in Libra now in September, there is a chance and opportunity for you to connect with people. I mean, you can connect with people and you look, look how many people are present here. And um, definitely your charm, your luck is in connections even if this pile of work that is mm, behind you or is in front of you maybe that you need to take care of it people are going to make it easy for you i mean either they're going to help you they're going to be taking some part of it or they're going to give you ideas i mean i see that there is some pile in front of you some kind of stuck energy some not really an obstacle but something that you think hmm, i'm not it's too big for me i can get over it or i can't do it but people can help you the message for you in september is that reach out reach out to people talk to people if you don't have any obstacle if you don't have any problem just work on your co connections and try to build connections with other people you might go to a conference you might go to a show to a theater to a concert somewhere that you build connections and talk to many different people you might be traveling but again it's like a even a ceremony or a work gathering or a seminar that people talk to each other, um, you can make a lot of friends and a lot build some relationships that in the future is going to be helpful. I see a, f a female figure who is sorry about what they have done, like, and they might want to go to their father or to father figure. An example is that like a young lady or a young girl is upset or is sorry about what they have done and they want to go to their father or father figure to apologize, but they don't know how to. It could be that some people, they have a cold relationship with their father, or again, a father figure, and they are on the way, on the, on the thought of how I can make it work, how can I make it correct, how can I uh, Im improve my relationship with this person. It can be also your boss or your 
mentor, your therapist, your doctor, but try to be on a positive side with them. Try to be, uh, try to be aligned with them. If someone is learning new languages or new currency you might be investing, there is some wish that you have, but it's a little bit unrealistic or you just are at the, po at the, time, at the point of wishing and you're not really uh, doing anything about it. Like if I sit and wish every night, maybe, I mean, it's really hard to, I also need to take some action. So you didn't, you didn't, um, uh, you didn't see the, you didn't plant the seed at the right place. Like for example, if I see the plant in the driveway, well, it's not gonna grow. Or you light a candle and you put it next to the window or in front of the fan, so it's not gonna be. So something like that, there is, you need to adjust or you need to make some adjustment. You need to change some parameters. Um, someone with bad energy, negative energy is leaving your life or their uh, dishonesty is coming to the surface. You will know that. And it gives you a lot of peace of mind that you, actually find out who this person really is and who truly um, they are and what their intention really is someone again is going on vacation you might take a, a nice travel and i see someone has turned a cold shoulder towards you someone is working long hours um i see one person is coming to you that you have been um, missing them or you haven't seen them for a long time maybe not necessarily missing them Mm, I see growth, but you know, be careful where you plant your seeds because sometimes you plant the seed in a wrong, uh, in a wrong place. So it can be, um, again, it can be anything. Maybe you trust the wrong person. Um, yeah, I mean, something is coming into completion for you. Um, your mood might be a little bit changing so try to control that. I see some kind of waves and I see the energy of the water. So again, maybe flooding waves uh, is are there. They expect some changes, expect some unexpected. Um, you or someone think that they are well prepared for in like mm, emergency situation, but I see that what they are thinking as a safeguard is not very like safe, I don't know. And what they are relying on is not truly there. So for example, if you have, um, if you think that you have an alarming system, but actually maybe it ran out of battery and it's not working so something like that big make sure that all the safety or whatever that you have as precautions are in place and they're working properly i see a bar someone is in a bar glass of wine glass of uh i don't know uh, drinks that you are having good times is coming you will celebrate something some of you are going on a solo trip uh, somewhere that you don't speak the language or it's a foreign country and you'll just enjoy seeing foreigners and you just take some time for you maybe it's a business trip um so i might go for a checkup medical checkup um a lot of thoughts again i see a little bit of dissatisfaction but be positive i see a lot of things are going to improve for you um if you need money I think a portion of it comes to you if you requested money or if you um, if someone borrowed money and they haven't um, returned it they will return a portion of it soon or if you're waiting for a commission for a bonus it comes I see letters P and C uh, and P and C are going to be closer together and um, yeah, there is a lot of people in your reading. You will see, get to know many people, but I don't see deep connections with them. Um, but uh, there's opportunities for you, each of them, even if they are present in your life for a short time, they are going to have an, an impact in your life. And that's why they show up in your life. Well, Sagittarius, that was your reading for September. I hope, sorry, I said Sagittarius. This is for Capricorn. So sorry about that. This is for Capricorn. Capricorn, this was your reading. I hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. And until the next time, maybe a Sagittarius is coming into your way. Until the next time, stay blessed.